Over the years, we've entertained many theories regarding narcissists and what's wrong with them, from them being demonically possessed to them being empty cedars, hollow men, hollow women, and many other terms attempting to describe them. I came across a theory, however, that might explain everything. While watching a Mr. Ballin video, he told the story of a man who experienced severe radiation poisoning. As a result, he entered into a phase called the walking ghost phase. During this phase, a person seems to be in good health, but they have in fact already died. The radiation has destroyed the cells responsible for producing new cells. So whatever cells are present at the time of poisoning are the cells that remain until certain death. They are never replaced. The craziest part is this phase can last for days. So naturally, this makes me wonder about many different things, including if it's possible narcissists have this syndrome to some degree. They don't grow. They don't learn. They seem to be on autopilot. And they are stuck on repeat, repeating the same day, thoughts and actions over and over again. It's almost like they died, but are still somehow alive. Something snapped their chromosomes to the point where no new brain cells are being created. The only difference here is walking ghost syndrome only lasts for a few days or weeks, then they eventually die. In that time frame, they seem perfectly healthy and normal. So if this is possible, what if it's possible that there are people walking around who have in fact already died, but their fallout period is longer, lasting days, weeks, or even years? When you consider how narcissists and other evil people behave, it becomes easy to see the walking ghost theory in action. They behave like human beings who are operating on the brain stem only, able to satisfy basic survival instincts, but having no real needs outside of these instincts. Their memory is crude and rote, holding on to only a few simple things and remembering only how to run a few simple programs. To further this theory, I believe the day that they hold on to is the day that they actually died, it's the last day that they remember. If this is true, what caused them to die standing? A system-wide cell death, really a shutting down of the cell factories. What causes their bodies to hold on to the physical when the mind is no longer there? What, if anything, can prolong physical death to the extent that this theory would suggest? And is there anything that can be done to bring them back to life? I don't know, but I think it's an interesting theory to think about. I've included links below for you to research this theory yourself, and I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching A Deeper PTE.